Lotus of Chaos with DC and this is an overview of Artemis in Smite. First let's go over her skins. So the original orange or red head, whichever you like to call it, covered green armor and then we have the Go girl, girl Wrangler outfit. The Convention 2012 skin which you could have gotten free if you were at the convention or you can buy it from the internet but it costs a lot and people are willing to pay for it. And the final is the stalker which you could get by tweeting about smite. I do not know if it is still possible to get by tweeting so now let's get to her abilities. Artemis has high single target damage. Artemis has a passive ability which gives you a critical strike chance buff. Each successful hit it, it stacks 3 times and the chance is per hit is 5%. The buff lasts for 4 seconds. Now let's go over the active abilities. Artemis' first ability is called Transgressor's Fate which traps the enemy guard so they cannot move and it inflicts damage from 25 to 80 depending on your skill level. With the skill, with added 30% bonus of your physical power. Now let's have a few demonstrations of this ability. Here you can see this guy is escaping from us and we trap him. And over here we are blocking the path so the en enemy guards cannot go through here. But they can but they will get stuck and I can bomb them easily then. Here the trap is over there, I don't know what that god guy player is doing, but he's got owned on it. The second ability of Artemis is called Vengeful Assault, which gives faster attack speed from 35 to 75 depending on the skill level. And it also gives you increased movement speed by 20%. Artemis' third ability is an area of effect, Wolle, called Super Stangeland. This ability does high damage and also has 30% of your physical power bonus. It slows down the enemies, hit by 25% for 2 seconds. Here are demonstrations for this skill. Artemis' fourth ability is her ultimate called the Caledonian Boar, which summons a boar that rushes at your enemy and stuns them. After the first enemy is stunned, the boar will continue to rush at your enemies to stun them. This boar can also be used as a tank to mitigate damage from towers, but that is how I use it. Let's have some demonstrations. You can see here that I summon the boar and it stuns that guy, and then it stuns the other one. Then you get owned. Here I am trying to use it as a tank and the extra damage against that tower. Same thing here. This is just on me using all the abilities against the enemies. As you can see one got trapped there by the first ability. And this is another of me showing all the abilities. I drop one trap here, assuming an enemy could come and run to it like an idiot. But no, and here I use the AOE attack. Lay another trap and then I will use the speed boost attack to kill that Minotaur faster soon over here. Got kind of lag so good on the aim that good over there, but you know. Woohoo! That is awesome. That was the overview for Artemis. 
Have a nice day and goodbye.